How is it going, guys? Um, today we are going to be playing a. I mean, we're not going to be playing, but I will be doing a tutorial on how to make a Fine Edge of Freddy's fan game on Hyperpad. So, let's get right into this. So, um, we'll be needing to create a new project, create a new project. And then, and shake all this FNAF YouTube And then, yeah So, you have a blank screen And first we're gonna start with Office so, First, you want to get the Office image If the image is too big, you'll resize it, but don't worry, it doesn't affect the image. It doesn't ruin anything. Now, if the, it becomes too big for the thing, then just resize it. And, as you can see, I can only get the corners. You'll want to unlink it, then you can size it however you want. I like to have it like this because when it's like like normal and you you end up like getting getting like you can only see like only like a quarter of the hallways missing so when you play you'll get something like this but you can't look around or anything let's fix that make sure you're on the scene ui and then get an empty object and then unlink it and you can set it however you want um, I did it a special way, but I'm just going to show you how to do it the basic way, if you're a beginner in the hyperpad. Um, hang on. Just let me move it. Hang on. Oh, it's good. Make sure you're on the move tool, because if you... If you're not on the move tool, then you can't move objects. But so, size it however you want. Make sure you put it on the left side of the screen. And let's make this. So, if you start touching this object, then make a screen to point. And then just make it, just set it right here. Because you could be tapping it to go over here. And, and, yeah, but you don't want it to be like actually like teleport your screen to there. So you want to actually like make it um like look like you're actually turning your head. So it set this to one second, and then what you want to do is copy it and put it on the other side, and then tap it, tap behaviors, and then. And make it set it so that it will turn to the right side of the office. And since we copied the object, um, duplicated it, it has these behaviors, and we don't have to do anything, we just have to set the screen. Then you should get this. Yeah, so that's how you, that way you can look left and right. Now, we're gonna, like, um, so the, like, um, time. So, you can grab whatever font you like, but, yeah, I'm just gonna use 8-bit, because Fine Spreads is, like, an 8-bit, and then Fine Spreads font isn't like this, but I'm just gonna use it anyway. Okay, so that this on night 1. You can make it whatever color you want and just want to stick in flight. And you can also place this wherever you want. I like to do it like this. And then 
um, you don't need to copy it for this, but I just want to, because I don't want to have to keep dragging it in. So it's, it's going to start off as 12 a.m. And this is going to be right there. Then And make something that says a.m. Get space that up. And, um, so, now what we're going to do is we're going to make the time go. So, you're going to set up a wait behavior and make it so you can, you can do this with every time you want, but I'm going to make it so that every hour is one minute, so I'm going to set 60 seconds. And then... I'm gonna make this and says add to score and if it's not set on twelve, set it on twelve and and since there's twelve and we want one AM, we're gonna do this. Okay. We're gonna set it to minus eleven, so we'll only have one point, even though these aren't points. And then now that's that one, that way we it can move up to 5 a.m. And then we'll, oh, in another tutorial, I'll teach you how to do 6 a.m. And, okay, so we're going to set this. It's to be, um, make it the time that you want each hour to be. And then, oh, whoops. Don't use a wait behavior. Use a timer. Because that means they'll do it every 60 seconds. So, if I put 60 in here, the timer will loop it every 60 seconds. And get set every 60 seconds, it will add one, one to the hour. So once it's 1 a.m. is what this thing does. And then it can get 2 a.m., 3 a.m., 4 a.m., 5 a.m. And we we'll gonna need to set it up to when the score reaches 6. Yeah. But for now, um, you just gonna have that, and then, yeah, then you'll have time that works, and, yeah, the time will work, and now, what, actually, fine, I'll teach you how to do 6 a.m. now. Get another level, and call it 6 a.m. And friends, Freddy's, um, like, um, you see, like, the, um, like, there's the 5 a.m., and then it goes down, the 5 goes down, and then it shows 6. So, to do that, you can, I'm just too lazy to get some, I get a graphic for this, and so that's why I'm just gonna do it like this. Just, I'm just gonna change that all to black, and now, set to a regional place. And then, well, actually, we're not going to do that yet. Oh, hang on. Huh. <coughs> Excuse me. That's rude. And, but yeah. You can set this just to be 5 and put the AM separate and put the 5 even 6. But I'm, just, but I'm too late for that, so I'm just going to say 5 AM. And you can set to whatever you want again. And then, set to white. You can do whatever color you want again. Um, then we want this to be 6 a.m. And I highly recommend um, make, making in the labels before you put in the black things. Because now 6 a.m. is going to be a, um, over... Lapping the black part, see, or, oh. Okay, so, since it's there, you should get this. Now, I'm just going to make extra sure, so I'm just going to duplicate that just in case. And I'm going to have this. But, yeah. So, then you're going to have your 5 a.m., and if you have your own 6 a.m. tone, then you can. And 
I'm just gonna say this to it after three seconds. Um, this will move down onwards under the black thing. So it's going to move. Set this on the Y. Move down. I'm just gonna set it to move down ten. Move down to just so it's on the screen. And then we're gonna set set the six a.m. to wait after, or whatever time was on the five a.m. Y'all have to set it on this, so it'll move at the same time as five a.m. And then I'm just gonna set this to move and make sure this is this it moves downwards really short because um or else you're it's just gonna get out. Duh. Oh, whoops. Oh, whatever. Let's just see what happens. Then, boom. So, now, let's check out what happens. So, when you're playing the game, it really looks like this. Then you get 6 a.m. Then you could, there's like, ding dong, and it's like, yay! And but yeah, so that's the, that's it for for now, guys. Um, please subscribe for more. Or er, um, please um like, comment, and and I'll do another tutorial. And yeah, bye. Peace.